What's up, y'all? What's up, y'all? What's up, y'all? What, 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 what's up, y'all? Nah, all right, that's enough. Okay, hello, beautiful people. Let's start with brows done, right? Eyelids prime, right? Eye sockets fucking sketched out, right? We're gonna take our Jaclyn Hill palette, this brush, and you know what? You gotta excuse me for looking down in the beginning part of this movie, or movie, video, because... I put my mirror down in front of me and usually I have it up high, so I'm looking down. But what I'm doing with this first shade here is I am just sketching out the shape I want because I'm going to do a cut crease. I mean, you guys seen the thumbnail, so I'm going to do that look, right? But I have to edge out my shape I want before, um, you know, I'm just packing on the color. I'm not blending out anything yet. But see the shape? See that? That's what I want. Now I'm going to go in with this shade right above it. And that's what I'm going to blend this shade out with. That first shade out with. Okay, I'm realizing what I'm saying isn't making very much sense. So I'm going to start naming the shades and the stuff I'm using. So then that way, you know, it doesn't get confusing. So that first shade I use is called Living My Best. I sh um, just packed that on in the shape I want. Then I went above that with the color Heart On to blend out that first shade. And I'm going to go back on with living my best just to, you know, bring that color back out. And of course, I'm blasting my music. So, you know, jam sesh. Okay, so now we're going to go in with this black shade called Temptress. And I am using a really flat shader brush. And I'm really like just stamping on the color because I'm going to go back in with that living my best to blend that out. I left it in this clip so you guys can see a little bit more clearly on how I'm stamping just the shape right above the crease, just barely even visible, right? Okay, so now that that's done, I'm gonna get me a little, like a little, um, not a bullet brush, but like a little pointed, pointed brush, right? And I'm gonna blend that out into that red, into the pink. Now I'm going to take my P. Louise base and I will cut the crease. I was using the wrong um, brush to cut my crease, so I had to switch that up. Okay, so now going back in the palette with that shade Heart on, we're going to go in with that first like one third of the lid and just pack this color on in there. And now with that first shade, living my best on most of that, you know, the rest of that lid, but save the tail for the black. We're going to go back in with Temptress. Here I didn't show it, but this is where I dipped in a temptress with a very small pencil brush. All I'm doing basically is just tracing that tail out and then I'm gonna blend the red and the black together. Now I'm going in with my Urban Decay Glitter Liner and I'm just going to basically draw a line right where the red, right where that cut crease is. And it's actually your preference where you want this glitter liner to stop. Some people want it to stop like in the middle. Some people on the two thirds of the eyes and some people want it to go all the way out to the tail. Totally up to you. I wouldn't mind to mostly go out all the way to the end, but not quite. Okay, take these sticky tapes off. We're gonna wipe off the little fallout that we did have. 
And while I do my lashes, I can apply my primer. So now I'm gonna apply my telescopic um, mascara from L'Oreal. I just need a light coat because I'm gonna apply some lashes. And um, while I'm doing this, my glue is drying. We're just gonna pop these babies on so we can head on to the next step. I'm using my Juvia's Place foundation, which is starting to come for my MAC foundation's neck. Like, this is a really close second, and I've been using it a lot more than I've been using the MAC, and I'm okay with that. If you haven't already checked out my Flawless Foundation Routine, I will link that in the description box below. The LA Girl Pro Concealer is my favorite and only concealer I like to use. So I'm gonna highlight and then um, blend that out with my Real Techniques Blending Sponge. Now I'm going to set with my Sasha Buttercup setting powder. And contour with my Black Radiance Contour Kit. To highlight, I'm gonna go on with this shade in the It's My Ray Ray um, uh, Shadow and Highlighting Kit. For blush, I'm using the Sweet Cheeks from NYX Cosmetics in the, in the shade Citrine Rose. For the lower lash line, we're gonna start off um, with Living My Best. We're gonna put that on a little short packer brush. I always use this brush for my under eyes. And then um, closer to the lash line, we're gonna use that Heart On shade. Grabbing another pencil brush, I'm gonna blend those colors together. Okay, I'm gonna put this black in my waterline. I didn't show it because I couldn't. And then I'm gonna spray my face, add my nude lip, and um, we're almost done, guys. Okay, so my voiceover is kinda not working right so i'm gonna have to improvise a little bit but for my lip girl just get you a dark brown lip liner and some cute new lip gloss that's what i did this was the elf iris um lip gloss you know it's like a compact i uh, got it from elf it was only like six dollars girl but anyway i'm gonna put this together and then blend out some you know nude lips Once I apply my lower mascara, girl, the look is done. Um, actually, I really like this look and how it came out. It's a lot vampier and red for me, like for what I usually do, but I actually liked it. So, if you haven't already, please make sure you have liked this video, subscribe to be my friend, because we're friends now, right? And check out other videos I have. I am creating playlists, so it'll, you know, make it more simpler for everyone who wants to see more of my videos. I love y'all, and I'll talk to you soon. Mwah! Bye.